Before using Kiroku regularly with patients, we strongly recommend customizing a stock template or importing your own template so that the structure of your notes suits your workflow. From your dashboard, select the relevant template to start taking notes. The top section of the note writing screen contains important tools such as copy notes and saved drafts. Along the bottom, you can view and navigate to individual sections that make up your notes. Sections can be reordered or deleted. Lines of notes can also be deleted, reordered or amended to reflect what's happening during the appointment. To start taking notes, just click the relevant buttons. You can reset any line by clicking the option on the left of the line. Some buttons only allow one option, others multiple. You'll see that some buttons generate new lines. These appear to prompt you to add additional details to your notes. If the options don't work, just click the other button to remove and start typing. If you want to add what you've just typed as a button option for the future, you can click the green underlined text and click the speech bubble to confirm. You can click into any text on any line to start typing and amend it. If you want to note something that isn't built into a template, simply add a new line. You can do this by pressing the enter key at the end of a completed line and start typing. Alternatively, click the add line button at the end of a section. You can then drag that line to the correct place within the same section. You can also delete unused lines individually or leave them unclicked and use the skip remaining lines button at the end of each section to clear them. Let's click through my template to show you the power of Kuroku's linked lines. You can see that sections I have not yet reached are already populated with relevant information. These act as prompts for you to convey information to patients as well as saving you from typing. There are a few additional features that come in handy when completing appointments, but they're not essential. We'll cover them in more detail in other videos. If for whatever reason you need to finish your notes later, simply click Save to Drafts, add in some detail so that you can identify these notes later. You can then pick back up where you left off from the Drafts page. So now my notes are almost finished. However, if I try to copy my notes, I get an error message. This is to let me know that there are areas of my notes that are incomplete. I can complete or delete these areas if they're not relevant. I can then preview my finished note at the bottom of the screen. Click Copy Notes to complete your appointment. This will then save the notes to your clipboard, ready to be pasted into your record system. You can also copy individual sections if you need. To start your next appointment, simply pick the next template from the menu option in the top left corner or at the bottom of the notes writer screen. There's no need to go back to your dashboard. This video has covered all the essential information you need to complete appointments using Kuroku. Don't forget to watch other videos to explore extra features that could save you time when taking notes.